Hello. Hello. How we doing? I'm fine. I live across the street. Yes, ma'am. Captain Patchett's my son. Yep. I saw a car pull in. This is the owner. I called her. Okay. She lives around the corner. And when I came over here, a girl was going in the mailbox. And I pulled up and said, what are you doing? And she says, I'm a census taker. They didn't show me ID. She went and got in the car and they were going to leave. And there's another girl driving. They won't show us ID. Won't roll windows down. Okay. All right. I, I'm, I, I'm not. Cindy Moss. Yeah, how do you shake your hand? But, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't want... Yeah, not that she, she asked anything, them to roll the window down and talk to her, and they wouldn't do yeah, that either. Yeah, I went up to ask. I own this place, and I went mm -hmm. up to ask them, and all she did was put her phone up to start recording me. Okay. I said, "Could you just roll your window down, and we could talk?" And then so, and then uh, Lois called, and it turns out they've already called to say we were detaining him. But isn't it a federal offense? To I be just asked for ID. And why was she was looking in the mailbox? Was she putting something in your mailbox? She opened it up. And I don't know if she put anything in or out, but she was in the mailbox. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I just, Lois just called me, so I come over to talk to them, and they wouldn't even roll their window down to talk. Okay. But I, we've had a lot of, I mean, you might have heard, we've had a lot of people breaking in around here and stealing yeah, stuff. Yeah, I was here one down at the neighbor's place over there not that long ago. Oh, down the road on uh and It was Lewis. right next to your place. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, right down. Oh, really? Somebody stealing from there, too? Well, I don't know if he was stealing or not. I oh, think you had, called us. Oh, that was on the guy trespassing at 3.30 in the morning. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, we've had people that broke in since then. I doubt every yeah. broke windows and stole well, tools I guess I out of the to talk to you uh, at night then. shop. Um, I do know. I'll go check it out. But I do know the census is going door to door. Okay. But to don't they have them. any IDs to show? I don't know. I can figure that out. Yeah. I tell them. But we'll go talk to them and figure this out. Okay. Right. Excuse me, ladies. Can you five two six three twenty eight? Two Charles Robert Sam three four three. Hello. Can you have them not approach us, please? My daughter's crying over here. She's just trying to work and be a reason. All we're doing is she's conducting a survey for the uh, census, and we're locating an address. Can you, can you please come to that one? Hang tight. Can you hang tight for me over there, man? Okay, I'm going to go through this. Okay. So that's all we're doing, sir. Go ahead. And so we pulled in here. Yeah. Okay, so you're conducting a survey? Yes, and we're looking for this address, and then the, they're, she's, they're given addresses to look at, and, and this happened to be one. We came This in address? Here. Yes. Sir. Okay. And so we came in here, and this lady, before we knew it, she was on... Um, Blocking us in, and, okay. that, and saying that we're trespassing this and that. And I'm trying to leave, and then she's not letting us leave. All we're doing is trying to. She's trying to conduct her interview and look at. This is what she's doing. I don't know how she feels good about herself. Okay, what what for the Census Bureau are you guys conducting? Interviews. For. Yeah. For the census, you don't. Did they you're not aware of what the census is. No, I am aware. I'm just trying to figure yeah. out what your side of the story and if it's correct. If yes, you're actually working for the the census. If you want, you can get a. Oh, really? So you believe them and you don't believe no, us? No, but I'm here to figure out what's going on, ma'am. Okay. Can I see that? Do you guys have IDs on you? Yes, we do, sir. Do do you did you check their IDs? Yes, ma'am. You did? I don't think so. I saw you talking. Do you have an ID on you? Yes, I do. Can I have your ID as well as Samantha's? Can you get her ID as well? Ma'am, can I get your ID as well as Samantha's? Oh my gosh, this is crazy. This is why all this madness is happening. All of what madness, ma'am? Why didn't you check theirs? Where are the victims? I'm not done yet, ma'am. All I'm trying to figure out is make sure that you're supposed to be here. 
we're trying and also we're trying to leave and how is that okay that they're both I will address in? I will address that it's two crazy ladies Samantha do you have an ID are you okay what's going on you just scared okay how old are you Samantha 18 18 do you have an ID what's that You just don't have one on you? Can I get your information from you, Samantha? So why do you have to take all this information? All we're doing is getting an address. We're trying to leave. She's trying to do her job. She, she, she needs to do more interviews. Not just I understand one. that, but I get called. i got to conduct an investigation so of what's going why on. why are they able to block us right now? Well, you're on their property. How do I know it's even their property? All we're doing is in a driveway checking That's what I'm trying to address. figure out. You called us, did you not? Yes, for our safety. So and are we what feeling I, safe? I don't know. Do you feel safe? No, I now? do not. I feel okay. like you're on their side and not letting no, us out. I'm trying to conduct what's going on. So what are you doing now? I'm trying to identify who you are. Oh my gosh. And you're seeing our driver's license. You don't know who we are? I haven't seen her driver's license, ma'am. Because she's not driving. I'm not worried about your and driving. And she has her, she showed you her badge. That has her information and that has been verified. Does it have her date of birth on it, man? Passport. Oh my gosh. You're ridiculous. I'm trying to help you. How? How are you helping me when she's crying? My daughter's over here crying because this crazy lady over here is intimidating us. Okay. She's trying to figure out why somebody strange is on her property. So have her, can you have her leave? It's her property. Oh, and she can block us. That's okay. Good for her. No, it's not okay. But I'm trying to figure out what's going on. I, we already told you, sir. What else do you need? Do you need to call? I need Samantha's their... information. Oh, my gosh. Didn't you let us call it, too? Just like you did us, I need you to verify her information. I in front plan of you. on it. I don't have to do it in front of you, but I plan oh, on it, ma'am. Oh, wow. Okay. But you're doing it to us. You're intimidating us with them. How right? am I intimidating? Because you? you're getting all of our information over here, and she's just like, ooh, ooh, not like nothing. We're the victim. She's standing right over there. You asked her not to come by your car. Yes, but you have them blocking us still. And that's still okay for you. It's not okay for me. Then why I will don't you tell I will address that as soon as I'm done here. You spoke with them over there and you didn't And then I came to speak to you. So what did you ask them over there? Nothing? What's going on? What would you like me to do right now, ma'am? To have them leave back up. This is her property. We'll have her get out of your way as soon yes, as we're done here. Yes, can you have her do it now? No. Why not? Because I'm not going to. I'm still conducting an investigation, ma'am. Why are you in such a rush to leave right now? Because my daughter is crying. These two ladies have intimidated us. And How did they us intimidate out. you, ma'am? Oh, by blocking us out. Do you not see that? Are you I see her blocking you, yes. But she's worried because they get a lot of burglaries out oh, here. Oh, you think that we are here for... Burglary no, I really anything? don't, ma'am. Oh my gosh. Do you not get concerned when some strange person drives onto your property? No. You don't? No, I do not. Okay. Samantha, do you have a middle name? What's that? Angel? Thank you. So what happened today when she pulled up? I, she asked us what we were doing. We told her that, we're, that we what we were doing and we were checking an address and she said this is her private property and I said fine then we need to leave we're leaving and she, mm -hmm. she and then she just parked there she would not move okay. and so we said well we need to we need to leave and so she called uh, 911 mm -hmm. so that we can leave then she called her friend or whoever that is so how is that not intimidating us I wasn't here I don't know. Well, it's obvious right Did now. Do you not see that? I don't. Do you I don't not know why see you... that they're trying, that we're, we're trying to leave? Okay, but well, you can't leave right now. Okay. Do you feel safe now? No, I do not. How come, man? Because I don't trust them and I don't trust you. Did I do something wrong to not make you trust me? Yes. Okay, what did I do wrong? You treated us differently, that's how. I haven't treated you. Yes, I you treated have. you with nothing but respect. <laughs> Okay. Did you get inside the mailbox at all on the street? No, we didn't. She went to the left. Do you see? You even had to turn back because you couldn't see the address, right? So that's how the, this address is not very clear. 
So my yeah. daughter went to look at the mailbox to see if we were we were at the correct address, mm -hmm. and that was it. Okay. That's all Makes we did. Makes perfect sense. We, we're not trying. What are we going to take from this ugly address? Man, I don't think you are. But I didn't know well, that. What does she think that we're gonna take? She doesn't. Why does she she have doesn't to block want anybody here. Why did she have to block us in? She shouldn't have. Then go tell her that. I will. Then please do it right now. I will do. So how does that? How am I supposed to feel safe if you're not telling her anything? Ma'am, you should feel safe. How? Safe by those two ladies blocking us in? That's safe for you? How would you feel if it was your child? If the police were on scene, I would feel fine. No, I know it's not safe. I don't think so. It's not okay. Safe. Well, hang tight for me, okay? Can you 5263-2729, Last of Spelling, Boy Ocean Union, Tom Tom Edward, first of Maria, middle name Guadalupe, D-O-B. And I have a second one ready. Same last name, Boy Ocean Union Tom Tom Edward, first of Samantha, common spelling, middle angel, DOB's. Hey, yeah. And did you have ID on you, ma'am? I do. I do in my car. I'll just get your info. So, do you actually live here? Nobody no. lives here. No, no one lives here. I live right over, you can see it over there on Marcus Lane. But my daughter has, a daughter and son-in-law have stuff in here. Okay. Yeah. And it's your property? It's my property. Okay, can I get your information from you? Um, Cindy Moss, or Cynthia. <laughs> C-I-N-D-Y. Is it that Cynthia or Cindy? Well, officially good. it's Cynthia, but I go by Cindy. Okay. And you said Moss? Yes, M-O-S-S. And a middle name for you, Cynthia? Lou. L. Oh, That's right. Yeah. I called her Cindy. And the date of birth? She says. What's up? How come you need all that? Just for documentation. Mm. Could you put maybe like a <laughs> 70 something? 85, 70 something. So, they are with the Census Bureau. Are they now? Why would she not show me ID and they tried to leave on me? I don't know. They said and why was look she at, in the look, mailbox? I just hate where she records everything. That's just driving me freaking I, crazy. I get it, but she can. Um, she was recording me too. Okay. Um, I tried to talk with her just to see what was going on, and she wouldn't even roll her no, window she wouldn't down. Me, neither one. The girl on that side is the one that was had the mailbox door open, and the, so she had the mailbox open. The mailbox door was open, and I asked, "Who are you, and what are you doing?" And oh, she says, "I'm a now." Census taker. I says, do you we have live, ID? I've lived she here for... She got the car and they were going to leave. Okay. A million years. She wanted me to move my car so I could take the and I wouldn't move my car. Okay, so I, five, two, six, or I asked call. for ID. What's wrong with asking for ID? Well, the, the census people are supposed to provide it. Last of Moss. She went, yeah, first of she, Cynthia. Middle Lou. Deal she, she asked the same thing and they wouldn't. Yeah, she wouldn't even roll her window down. All she did is she's recording everything. They said that... You, she felt intimidated by you folks. Oh, okay. Him let him in, I pulled is... in the driveway and she was had the door of the mailbox open and I said, who are you and what are you doing? And she said, census taker. Hey, I said, show me ID. Oh, Go ahead. Is there anything wrong with that part? I'm a... Have you talked to the so daughter's 18, right? She's the worker. Yeah. Have you talked to her separate yet? Not separate, no. But she's got a badge. And... Right, but she needs to, like, I'm, I'm, from what I understand, I think it's per their policy as well, they're supposed to provide the ID that they're with the census when asked. Or even when they show up, they're supposed to provide the census badge. Do you want to talk to her? I've never heard that before. What's that? I've never heard. I don't know how the census They're works. supposed to. So, I mean, I've had one come to my house the other day, and I said, yeah, here, here's my badge. So, hey. <coughs> is it posted that no trespass or anything like that? Or? There's on this property and all around the farm. Is it posted? Yes, it is. Okay, Cindy, sir. is it posted here no trespassing as well? 
I don't know if it's on this, but it's okay. my property. Um, this is my cousin that lives around here, and he's, mm -hmm. can you, he's, go ahead. So, I, uh, this, this car here, they're, they're parked a lot every evening on the New York Canal Bank, which is right over here. This which one specifically? I, if it ain't an identical copy, in fact, they're there every evening. Hold on just a minute. We'll be with you in a minute. But anyway, I, it's a car very simple to put that one. Okay. I'm not saying it's exactly them, but I see them every night on the corner. Right over well, he's, yeah, he's a farmer. He farms yeah, all this. You, you should give us a call in the future. When you see it on the bank, okay. give us a call. Okay. So we can go out and investigate. And the crazy thing about it, we've, we've put up signs down the New York Canal and the Irrigation District and we're supposed to be the only ones on it with our property and stuff. Mm -hmm. And it's crazy. People ignore those signs and we get people walking their dogs, which is fine that to a degree, but then it's like an invitation for everybody and their dog. That, right. and, yeah. so it's, and I know you guys, well, we don't bother you guys with those calls because it's like, uh, you got more to do than that. Right. Well, they broke in the shop, they stole all the tools, they broke in the house, stole all yeah. kinds of stuff across the street. They've been stealing anything and everything. I uh, Did you ask her about who was in the mailbox here? The lady on this side. I did. They said they were trying to find the specific address and they couldn't really tell if it was a correct one. It was one, on so the side looked. of the box because I found it. They, they said that, that they looked on the side. They said they didn't get inside the mailbox. Well, that door was open and she had it in her hand. Okay. Well, thank you. Yeah. So, yeah, well, let's... You guys take care. I spoke with you a while back about the guy beating in the door oh, way one. back in the day. Uh, you look familiar. Yeah, yeah, these two were around the corner up the road. And was kind of there was that blue house, and then I confirmed his address because he had kicked in the guy's door probably, what, six, eight weeks ago? Well, let's, let's deal with these guys real quick. You guys take care. Thank, thank, thank you for your help. Okay. Um, I don't think I have your ID. In the future, I wouldn't try and block him in. Just try and get. Okay. Well, I wasn't here at first. I just got here. Lois was here and I she called me. I in and they tried to leave. And how come and I... And I can't do nothing, uh, you know, I... And, and I mean, just if they're on my property and they're not supposed to be, I can't block them in. I wouldn't. I would just try and get a plate. How come, I did take a picture how of the plate you, and they saw me do how it. How come you don't block them? Just for your safety reasons. And you don't well, know, you don't know who they are. They don't know if they have any weapons. Oh yeah. Things can get escalated from there. I've tried. We tried okay. to block the people that were stealing in on the farm. I don't know, two or three weeks ago. Remember? And I put my oh, car. Oh, uh -huh. And I figured they probably do have weapons. You never know. Whose car's what? Mine's the Mine's black one. Mine's the white one. Okay. If we want to go ahead and start moving those. I have to come up and turn around. Okay, is I there can't see so they're out. just free to go after they were acting like this and recording this whole thing? I would say I would have talked to them and said, "Okay, fine." I can I can trespass them from the property. Okay, please. You know, otherwise I'm usually it, it would have been fine, but where they're acting so rotten and trying to say they feel threatened. Okay, I was out okay. with the chickens. I mean, really. Okay, so I can. <laughs> and and I can we're a couple of old ladies here. <laughs> so I'll, I can trespass them from the yes, property. Yes, please. Okay. I mean, I usually, it's, I'm really easy I just things, asked for ID, and she got in the car and I wanted to leave. I wonder if they aren't the girlfriends of the gal that used to live here. One of them looks kind of familiar, but I can't get a hold of her. Okay, so. well, they have census badge, so. Do they? Okay. They do. I feel sorry for the one girl on this side. She seems a little upset. She's upset. Yeah. She is. I mean, I feel sorry for them, but then will your window down, show your badge, and, and do decent. They went, and they got in the car and wanted to leave. I Only move my car. I understand. I can't. I'm not packing out on this road. Those trucks do 80 through here. Oh, yeah, we need to come in here and turn around. I, well, I can go in the weeds we, we this can, way. We can go and stop traffic for you. I can go in the weeds this way, and then you can follow me. I can just stop traffic for you. Oh, you don't want us just to come out here and I turn around? I can stop traffic for you. Oh, that's embarrassing. <laughs> that was embarrassing. <laughs> yeah, if you'll do that, then that would be the girl who's actually a sense of back along.
All right, Samantha, right? Are you okay? No. Okay, you just scared? Okay. How long have you worked for the census? About three to four weeks. Three to four weeks? Did you, did they ask to identify yourself at all as a census? Well, they said, what are you doing here? I said, I'm from the U.S. Census Bureau and I pulled out my badge like I'm supposed to do. Oh, you did pull out your badge? Yeah. Okay. All right. That was my main thing is, is they said they never saw a badge. And as far as I understand, you're, you're supposed to identify yourself with your badge. Okay. All right. It's okay. You don't need to be upset. All right. We're getting them to leave you alone. Um, but they were concerned. They weren't sure who you guys were. Okay. And they're on their property and refused to identify people. They didn't refuse to identify them. But she, we told them we were doing and when I told them we were looking for the address, she said, oh, well, you're trespassing. I said, well, we'd like to leave now. We need to check, check the address. And she blocked us.
What's that? But yes, it's part of the policy. Yeah. I'll start that. So, did your advisor talk to better handle a situation like this instead of trying to intimidate people? He did, in fact. But still. So, before you two go, the homeowner is requesting that you guys are trespassed from this property so you're not allowed back, okay? No problem, sir. Okay. All right, take care. I would never want to be at this trashy place again. Okay. Take care, okay? Okay. 